Hello everyone, Sam is from myforestmagicweb.com. Um, I think this is a small video as a weekly recap. So let's get it started at the last week. I uh, started on the 10th, I guess, right? But um, the first trade is on the 11th, USD CAD from 20 minute. Uh, beautiful short entry here. SL uh, and SL have moved to break even, 105 pip. And on the 11th, you have a USD uh, to the long side. Because of the USD weakness, you know, USD pound, USD, they went up, USD CAD, USD franc, USD yen, they came down because of the USD weakness. Okay, and then on the 11, you can see the pound USD. This was an entry, came down, beautiful, another entry, but you know, I held this one here and the 75 pip here. And now USD yen, like I said, the USD weakness and yen strength actually uh, caused this uh, to the downside on the 12th. 100 pip here, and then Euro Aussie 20, pip, uh, 20 minute chart on the 12th sell order here, beautiful coming down for 50 pip only, but you know, something. Uh, Pound Nuzi 20 minute, beautiful by the book entry here, and went down for 65 pip. And here, Pound Yen, nice entry on the 13th, came down for 75 pip and pound yen on the 14th the next day this was the first one i just showed you and he retraced and again that made gave me a good beautiful entry and i'll show you why i took this entry is because of the yen strength actually just another 75 pip here um so these are few trades not too much because uh, the volume is not back yet um so next week maybe uh we will have some uh volume coming back in now let me show you why i had this usd yen pound yen on the 13th of pound yen on the 14th uh basically um uh, let me show you first this, this yen index chart yen index chart i made this one long time ago it says that it's gonna go up for if c uh, point c actually it's like x a b and then point c for a harmonic pattern and uh and from there it's supposed to drop for point d so what happened to this chart after this, this is what happened. It went up there, it, you know, posting this uh, two points here, right? So now instead of this X, A, B, and I says, okay, now we have another pattern here. This is the, you know, the beauty of these harmonic patterns. If you know how to uh, pinpoint them and trade them uh, creatively. So now X, A, B, C, and then I said, well, D, this is a bad pattern. 88 uh, percent and it's supposed to drop from there and when it's going to drop then this will happen all this will send all yen pairs to the downside and that's the reason this is on the 12th right so see on the 12th i had this first trade usd yen under pip to the downside then i had pound yen 75 pip on the 13th and pound yen on the 14th another 75 pip these are the three trades, 100 pip, 35 pip, 75 pip, only because of this yen index chart, which was making a harmonic pattern called bad pattern, right? So uh, this is the power of it. And um, <clears throat> so this is it for now. And um, uh, I think it's more to come. So uh, yen pairs will probably be, uh, you know, going down more next week. So let's see how the, the you know, the fund is going to help us out. So this is it for now. Uh, and if you uh, want to be a part of it, you want to learn, you want to get the system go on my website, subscribe and uh, start learning today. Saturday, you have a Sunday sign up and uh, get the charts, get the system, uh, make the charts ready and then start trading and learning. All right. So this is it for now. Again, um, uh, going back here, look at these two beautiful 75 pip from here to here and then 75 pip from here to here. All right, so this is it for now and talk to you guys later.